I think it's really about working hard, you know, and I know it's cliche, we hear it all the time. But one of the things that's really important for whatever sport you're in, you know, and even whatever you want to do, is being able to, like we got so programmed into you're the five player, you're the post player, you're the guard, you're the this, but being able to be versatile. And so work on your ball handling, work on your passing, work on all the great things. But I think ultimately love the game. When you love what you do, I think for those of us that love what we do, when you love what you do, it shows in every single thing that you do. I was born with a hearing impairment. I was born with a hearing disability. My mom and dad found out when I was three years old. And for me, as I grew up, I really didn't know what that meant. Age five, I had my first hearing aid, first set of hearing aids. And even at that point, I had no idea what that really meant. But then we moved overseas, and we lived in Italy for a year. Came back when I was in second grade, and that was the first time that I knew and that I realized I was different. Every single day, I went to school. I got made fun of for the way that I talked, for the hearing aids I had to wear, for just being different, for being taller. Like, you name it, I got made fun of. You have people, and I know we all have them, that tell you you'll never be great. You'll never do this. You can't do that. You're not good enough. You can't talk. You can't, like, I've heard it all. And I think it really became something that inner drive of proving people wrong. But over time, it really got to a point where it's like, but I can do this. So it's not about proving somebody wrong. It's something that's like, I don't need to prove you, prove to you that I can do it. Like, I can do it. And not only can I do it, I want to excel at it and not to be to get accolades and not to get you know all these awards not for any of that just so that at the end of the day I can walk away and say I did that because I wanted to do it not because somebody told me I had to do it but because I wanted to do it and that every single day like I get up and I'm like okay let go because I love the challenge I love life we're blessed to have this opportunity. We're blessed to be here. There's a lot of things going on. And I just wake up every day. I'm just like, all right, God, like, what's up? What you got for me today? <laughs> when people ask me what I am most proud of from playing and being a professional basketball player, I am most proud of the impact that we have had on the young people that have come through every single year. So what do I know now that I didn't know then is that I'm, I would be okay. I think I feared like what will happen if I fail, what will happen if this, what, you know, like all oh, the what if. But really putting yourself in a position and knowing that if you work hard, you can accomplish anything you put your mind to. No matter how big it is, you can accomplish it. It's gonna take work, hard work. Thank <laughs> you.